I'm Steve Roberts again. I wanted to thank Richard Crawwick for heading all this up in North Carolina. And again, I wanted to mention that the focus of 100,000 Poets for Change in North Carolina is arts for education. So again, thank you, Richard, for organizing all this and all the work you put into it. I do have a poem I'd like to read. Um, Time Once, again. The sun turns the creek bed's sand silver, reflects off a silver key, half buried. Here is where riding bikes the summer before ninth grade, ready to pedal back home before noon to meet dad to go by the three speed we'd decided on, having asked my friend Dan over and over what time it was before realizing his wristwatch had to be going backward. I turned my outgrown Sears best one speed around and hightailed it home. But by the time I got there, Dad had already left, returned with one of the bikes I'd said I'd rather not have. But that he made me keep anyway to teach me a lesson never to be late. A prickly cockspur pulled from the bottom of my bare foot. Onto my shin I wiped the muck off the retrieved from the woods' titleist golf ball that smile cut deep revealed. The rickety old footbridge replaced by an asphalt cart path. A red spider's finely black legs mimic the red clay mud's black tire tread imprint. The ground underneath my parents' driveway cracked concrete washed out. The golf ball bounces hollow. Pine needles blanket the steep, ivy-laced bank, and two trees need to come down. Around a silver gossamer spins a silver leaf, and the silver key warm inside my shirt pocket journeys. Next up, a 